Hey, what's up guys? So yes, <clears throat> episode 13, one of us of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Top 5 moments right here by Jay Wink. Sorry to do a dramatic opening like that, but I needed to do it. Don't hate me for it. So, yes, here we go. My, my number 5. I do not have any honorable mentions at all this week so whew. but I'm gonna give you my rating right now five out of five winks I really did dig this episode it was fantastic I think they did a great job it was really I felt like it was really strong it was it was much more stronger than the last two episodes but let me talk about my top five moments here so yes number five is Sky's dad is recruiting you know people from the index now, yes, this is pretty much the premise of the episode, but I really did like to see um, this guy's dad at the beginning of the episode come and get that one chick with the blades on her fingers, you know, and come get her, and then them actually to go and get that one guy from that psychiatric prison. So, yeah, I really did like seeing, I, I, I like seeing people recruit people, you know, it's kind of like what Nick Fury did. And what Agent Coulson did, he recruited these, they both recruited team, all three of these guys, they recruited people, special people, for this team to take down a common enemy. Now, you know, Nick Fury and Agent Coulson, you know, were kind of on the right path, you know, going in the good guy direction. But Sky's dad went in the completely other direction, with going the other way around, and um, trying to kill Coulson. So yes, moving to my number four. Is May goes to get her ex husband to help Sky. Now, yes, I know this is pretty much pretty. The first two are pretty much both of my of the premise of the episode, but I really did like to see Scott, um, yeah, Sky talk to May's ex husband and May talk to her ex husband like that. I really did like to see that banter back and forth from Sky and her ex husband and um Scott and May's ex husband. Why do I keep saying Sky's ex husband? She's not married. God. But I did like to see that, and then I'd like to see every, pretty much every moment where May and her ex husband were all to, were, were together. I thought they did a great job. The actor who did that did a fantastic job. I think they both did an excellent job. You know, um, Ming Na Wen, and then also the guy who played. Andrew, I believe it is, her husband, her ex-husband, sorry, but I, I did like to see those two work together, I, I really like to see them, I'd really like to see him come back in the future, which he probably won't, but they did, he did a good job, they both had, I felt like they both had good chemistry together, and I really did like that, and I did like the interrogation scenes with Sky where she was trying to really avoid his questions, but not the point, well, it was the point, but moving to my number three, is that Coulson heads back to his town of birth, where he was born, to fight Cal, Sky's father. Now, yes, as Coulson said, he did not go to that school. Uh, who knows where he went, actually? But um, he actually did go to Wisconsin, to that one place in Wisconsin. I really, I really like to see that. Or Coulson actually was born in Wisconsin, and that is actually not too far from where I'm born, actually. No, like, state-wise, not city-wise. I don't live in Wisconsin. Are you joking? But, um, yes. Um, I really did like to see, um, when the radio announcement, when Cal was saying stuff about Coulson, you know, and how he killed the man he's been waiting two decades to kill. And that was really, you know, he just flipped out there for a second, and he's just like... Come on out. You know, I feel like he could be a real Joker character. You know, if he, you know, took some wrong steps, got some acid in his face. Well, got some, got dropped in a pile. Uh, well, you know, vat of acid, you know, and painted his, you know, face white. You know, I, I could kind of see him being like that. You know, being a stronger Joker. And I really do like him as a villain. I think he's a cool, he's a comedic, you know, he's got some comedy moments. And he does a great job. Kyle McC well, I'll call him Kyle, because I don't know, McLaren, I think, or McClacken, or so, something like that, something with an MC, I think, I know it starts with an M, 
But, um... Um, so... Yes, I do really like to see this sort of thing where, you know, so the, the villain calls out the hero in front of everybody, you know, because he knows he won't be able to stand a chance against all these bad guys and everything. But especially since he was holding these kids hostage, I really did like... To, uh, sorry, guys. I really did like to see that. I thought they did a great job with that. But, okay, so, moving to number two, I got way off track there, is Coulson and Mockingbird. Bert. Coulson, Mockingbird, and May versus the Index. Now, yes, I really did like to see this whole fight with um, Bobby taking on the blade chick um may taking on the big heavy guy i really did li i really did dig that slow motion when she's just walking over there and he's just like <coughs> <coughs> i can't do that or i'll lose my voice there sorry guys and i, I really did like that i thought that was pretty funny he, he, he was a pretty dumb character in my opinion but he was you know he was, he was just like <coughs> You know, oh, muscle, muscle, no brain, you know, as Coulson called it. Er, well, as Coulson said it earlier. And, you know, and then Coulson takes on that one guy. Ah, the fuck, what was his name? Sorry, guys, for swearing there. But, um, if, and if you didn't hear me, great, good job. Glad you didn't hear me. But, um, I also, uh, and then he also, well, that one guy that knocked out all those kids and everything, and the person that was in the psychiatric ward, um, and then the techie, techie guy, you know, I'm, you know, he took him out. And so the Coulson did do his job well. So yes, I did. I actually did like the fight. It was, it, you know, it was very cool. I really, I, but I, if I had to choose a favorite fight, I thought it would, it would have been Mockingbird and the Blade Chick fight. That was pretty good. So yes, moving to my number one. Spoilers, huge, heavy spoilers here. If you've not seen the episode, Mac reveals to Hunter who he's working for. It is the real shield, apparently, and also the after credit scene, you know, you know, and then the preview for next week, even though, well, that is pretty much the after, and then the after credit scene where, um, Sky's dad has to go talk to the guy who is keeping, you know, who is apparently in charge, who's going to decide what happens to him, and the preview for next week, oh my god. This is going to, next week's episode is going to be amazing. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm pretty sure that's going to be definitely five out of five winks. Especially if they keep going where they're going. If they really explain what happened to Sky's dad. You know, I saw Ward. He was in there. I hope he's with that new shield now. Um, um, and then I'm just saying a lot. I'm Because I'm just so freaking excited. Because my buddy Ward is back. Yes. But if he's not back, I'm going to be seriously ticked off. Because I swore I saw him in that preview. And I'm, I'm just really ticked off that now Coulson is going to be hunted by, you know, another people. And also, I did see that one chick from the Academy, that brown, that colored lady that was, that was from Vincent Sim that Simmons was talking to when Hydra went down. So yes, five out of five wings, guys. Really looking forward to next week. The shield sign was pretty cool. And... Oh, man, next week's gonna be awesome. I'll see you guys later. Jerry Wing, winking out.